All right, villagers. I got my cobblestones kind of cut out where I want them. I marked where I want my houses to sit. So all this is all cobblestone over here. So the next step in this process is to fill in all of the little grooves in between the stones. And you can do different colors, whatever you want. I chose this, this uh, brown, it's like a burnt umber. It's an acrylic based paint, water based. Um, what you do is you just pour some in a cup and then mix in some water with it so it gets it nice and nice and um, like soupy, you know, so you're not just using straight solid paint. And then what you do is you just take this very carefully, get it nice and mixed up. See how it's kind of drippy like that? What you want it to do is, actually I'm gonna add a little bit more water to this because I want it to be a little bit more runny. So just keep mixing it up, get it nice and mixed up in that cup. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take it and just kinda dab it like this down in between those, those bricks or the stones. Get it down in there, use your brush, get it down in between the stones. Don't worry about being sloppy in this area because you're gonna paint over a lot of these stones anyways. So just get it dabbed down in there really good. And that's what you, that's how you do it. And then the, the paint and the water will seep down in there and fill in all the cracks. And then when you're done, when it dries, then you can paint all the tops of your stones and it'll look really cool. I chose this for like an earth tone. You could use a gray, you could use a black, um, whatever you want. Sometimes if you're doing brick, let's say you're doing a brick pattern and you're doing it maybe on a fireplace or a or a Santa Claus looking thing for your North Pole villages, you'll want to leave the you'll want to leave the um, gaps in between the bricks white. So you just leave them white, and then you just go over the top of them, over the top of your bricks, with just a red paint. Try not to get it down inside of the um, inside the crick, inside the in, in the cracks in the bricks, and you'll have a you'll have a pretty cool looking fireplace or a, a brick wall or whatever, and it'll look really neat. So let me go ahead and finish this up and then I'll come back and show you what it looks like.